Los Angeles, 1932, the nations of the world march in the opening day ceremonies of the Olympic Games. Marching with the women's team from Poland, Stanislava Balashevich, known throughout the world as Stella Walsh. Stella Walsh is a resident of the United States who chose to represent her native country, Poland, here at the Los Angeles Games. When the immortal Babe Diedrichsen won two gold and one silver medal at the Los Angeles Games, she was considered the greatest female athlete ever. Yet there are some who consider Stella Walsh to be Babe's equal. Nevertheless, today Stella Walsh is all but unknown. August 2nd, 1932, the final of the women's 100-meter dash. Stella Walsh of Poland is the favorite. She has won her preliminary and semi-final heats. Stella Walsh is in lane five closest to the camera. Stella Walsh wins and sets a world and Olympic record. Afterwards, she says she will attempt to repeat her victory four years later. Berlin, 1936. 25-year-old Stella Walsh again represents Poland in the 100-meter final. Stella Walsh is on the left in lane six. Helen Stevens of the United States in the middle goes out to an early lead. Stella Walsh, just coming into the picture on the left, is coming on fast. Helen Stevens first, Stella Walsh second. In her career, Stella Walsh won more than 40 United States championships. And in 1946, 20 years after her first competition, she was still able to represent Poland in the European Championships. After her 1932 victory, it would be 36 years before another Polish woman athlete would win an individual gold medal in an Olympic track event. This is Irena Zhivinska of Poland. Like Stella Walsh, she is one of the greatest and most durable athletes in history. She has competed in four successive Olympiads and has won a total of three gold, two silver, and two bronze medals. Mexico City, 1968. The nations of the world parade in the opening day ceremonies of the 19th Summer Olympic Games. One of the members of the Polish team, 22-year-old Irena Zhivinska. Irena Zhivinska competed in her first Olympics four years before in Tokyo. Then she won silver medals in the long jump in 200 meters and climaxed her performance with a gold medal as part of the victorious Polish 4x100 relay team. October 18th, the final of the 200 meters. Irena Zhivinska is one of the eight finalists. This was my third individual event. In the long jump, I unfortunately did not qualify for the final. I made the final of the 100 meters, but was only able to finish third behind the American girls, Wyomi Atias and Barbara Farrell. I hoped to do better in the 200 meters, the race in which I won the silver medal four years earlier in Tokyo. Wyomi Atias, lane three from the inside, the winner of the 100-meter gold medal, starts out fastest of all. Irena Shavinska on the right in red shorts, trails in seventh place. Now Shavinska starts after the leaders. Irena Shavinska first. Raylene Boyle, Australia second. Jennifer Lemmy, Australia third. Irena Shevinska sets a new world and Olympic record. My husband Janusz, who is a sports photographer, and I returned to Poland after Mexico City, and we had not made a decision whether I should continue in competition. In February 1970, our son Andrzej was born, and soon after I regained my interest in running and decided to try again at the Munich 1972 Games. In the 200 meters, I was happy to win the bronze medal behind Renate Stescher of East Germany and Raylene Boyle of Australia. I was now determined to try for a fourth time at the Montreal 1976 Games. Montreal, 
1976, the opening day ceremonies of the Olympic Games. Thirty-year-old Irena Zhivinska will compete in a new event for her, the 400 meters. Before Montreal, she ran the 400 meters only 12 times, but she holds the world record and is the first woman to run that distance under 50 seconds. Irena Zhivinska is now being coached by her husband, Janusz. Before the Montreal Games, there was much speculation from the press as to whether Irena would compete in any event besides the 400 meters. We finally decided to concentrate on just this race. Irena did not like the 100 meters because of her poor starts. She was never able to overcome this handicap. The 200 meters is a speed event, which Irena likes. But the 400 meters combines both speed and the endurance she has built up through her many years of training. Therefore, we decided that the 400 meters was the perfect race for her, even though she had been running it for so short a time. July 29th, 1976, the final of the 400 meters. Irena Shavinska has a difficult time before the final. In her qualifying heat, she finished third. In her next preliminary, she finished fourth the last qualifying spot for the semifinals. But she makes a remarkable comeback by winning her semifinal heat and breaks the Olympic record. Irena Zhivinska's main opposition is expected to come from 18-year-old Kristina Brema of East Germany, the second woman to run the 400 meters under 50 seconds. Kristina Bremer is 14 years younger than Irena Zhivinska. It was a great honor to compete with such a wonderful sportswoman as Irena Shevinska. She has been an idol for me and my teammates. I was only six years old when Irena Shevinska won her first gold medal 12 years earlier in Tokyo. Never did I believe that one day I would compete against her in an Olympic final. Irena Shevinska is in lane four. Christina Bremer is in lane two on the inside. The runners will travel once around the 400 meter track. Because of the staggered lanes, it is difficult to see who is in front. As they go down the back stretch, Irena Zhivinska in the white shirt and red shorts trails. But she is the fastest and strongest of all during the final 200 meters. Into the final turn, Zhivinska wearing number 277 starts her final sprint. Christina Bremer is closest to the camera. Coming off the final turn, Zhivinska in the middle goes out in front. Christina Bremer at the top is second. Irena Zhivinska, Poland first. Christina Bremer, East Germany second. Ellen Streit, East Germany third. Irena Zhivinska has created a new world and Olympic record. It is Irena Zhivinska's seventh Olympic medal. In four Olympiads, she has won three gold, two silver, and two bronze medals. Irena Zhivinska of Poland, one of East Europe's greatest Olympic champions.